Hi, everybody. Welcome back to LERGP's weekly update. My name is Kevin Martin. I'm here with Jennifer Russo. We are going to talk about BEV. And for our growers in Western New York, maybe you forgot what BEV is um, because traditionally it's a Finger Lakes thing, but we are branching out and doing things virtually and providing uh, some additional opportunities. So to talk a little bit more about what that opportunity is, Jennifer? Yeah, hi, thank you, Kevin. Good morning, everybody. Like Kevin said, due to COVID, we're all so used to that now. It's just a part of life. Everything is virtual this year. We're not having our winter grower. I've heard it named Grape School by some of our growers. We're not having our winter conference. We're combining with the Finger Lakes and also the New York Wine and Grape Foundation this year as part of BEV. So they did give us an afternoon that was going to get beer, beer on a Friday. <laughs> they give us an afternoon that's going to be geared towards juice grape production. So that would be actually the Friday afternoon session. But please don't go to them all. You pay one price, you can go to any of the three days, any of the three different sections. And there's a lot of great information out there for business, analogy, and viticulture. But I wanna kind of show you also a chance for credits. Don't forget that. We keep getting calls about where you can get credits and you can get two on the Thursday afternoon session. I'll share my screen here. Here's the website. So it's just bevny.org, or that stands for BEV, Business Knowledge and Viticulture New York.org. It's next week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. There's a, I, you, this is all for you. You can go through and look at this, but I want to show you the important things of how to get there. You need to register for it. So there's a registration tab here. It is required. They will send you a link once you register, and that link is basically how you get on to everything. It's $75 a person. And if you are looking for credits, I have to tell you, each person has to register to get those credits. You can't have all of your team on one computer to get credits that day. Each individual person has to register in order to get credits. Now I wanna show you the next tab, which is our program tab over here. Here's a list. You can click it, click to print off a version of it of the day program all along. Business is always in the morning, Onology is always in mid-morning, early afternoon, and Viticulture is then in the afternoon. They range, don't go by just the 2 to 4, because some of them are 2.30 to 4.30, so make sure you double check your times on there. Also, if you look in the Viticulture section, any of the sections, and you see names that are highlighted, you can click on them, and it'll take you to their bio and what work they're doing and currently doing and have done. So let me stop my share. Again, we're combining efforts with the Finger Lakes group. It's just easier. We'd probably be putting together a very similar programming. So instead of making you go to so many different Zooms, we're all combining together, making sponsors go for one event this year. It's three days worth of programming and business analogy and viticulture all day long, choose as many as you want, choose as little as you want, $75 a person. And yeah, call us if you have any questions on it. Yeah, and I think, you know, I would just add full disclosure. You know, if you're a Concord um, grower, some of these topics, if that's all you do is grow Concord grapes and sell Concord grapes to a processing facility, some of these topics are going to be beyond the core of your business activities but they will, um, you know, if you have in intellectual curiosity about some of these subjects, this gives you an opportunity to fairly affordably, um, to fairly affordably get access to some really good speakers that we just, we don't have the ability to do that, especially in person here in the Lake Erie region, because we really do have to focus on the core of what you guys do. And we figured this would be a good opportunity to do that because we also figured, you know, if we put together eight hours of a conference that you think is all really important, a lot of you probably don't want to sit in front of a Zoom computer for eight hours. So in doing that, we, we sort of save our resources. And as soon as we can do something in person that is geared specifically towards Concords for more than a couple hours or, you know, for a full day of grape school kind of thing, we'll do that unless for some reason the first month we can do that is in October and then obviously we won't, but um, we're going to do that as, as soon as we can, whether it's a summer conference or uh, an early winter conference or we'll figure it out. 
Right. Just so you know, on the Friday afternoon session, Dr. Terry Bates will be speaking about the MyEV tool. We've had a lot of, during our grower advisory committee and just growers in general, reaching out with questions on data management. So there's a lot of good things on how that can help you in your operations on your farm. There's also Joe and Joseph Amsilly, who's a cover crop guy at Cornell. And he's gonna be there to talk about the different species and what they can do to help you in your vineyard management, floor management plans. Then we have Dan Olmstead. Dan Olmstead's gonna be talking about the new NUA website that's coming out and how that's gonna be more helpful to you and what you can do to utilize more information on your farm or easier access to, I guess. So. Yeah, exactly. That Friday afternoon session is gonna look a lot like our grape school other than the fact that obviously it's gonna be on Zoom. So for, for that, that amount of time, which is I think as much as we can expect from most, most people to try to sit through a Zoom, um, it'll look a whole lot like grape school. So you've got that going for you. Yeah, well, we hope to see you there. Yep. If you have future things that we'd like to hear about, please leave a comment below or send us an email. And remember that we are here for you, just not in person at this time. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next week. Uh, and we'll be talking a little bit about fertilizer. So um, please join us next week as well for an update on what's going on there. Uh, anything else, Jen? We good. No, happy great weekend. Yeah, we'll see you soon.